Hello, 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 D7 here with Grok a trade. Let's get after it. It's Wednesday, hump day, November 1st, 2017. And a big shout out to Mark the Meerkat for sitting in for me. His videos are awesome. He's our premier mentor and day trader. Check him out. You want to get mentored by him. Check this out. The markets are mixed with small caps doing the worst, down 0.66%. And if you go here, financials up a fraction, US dollar up a fraction, crude oil down 0.27%, gold higher by 0.3%, silver higher by 2.5% in the VIX break even. Let's take a look at the ETF. This is the S&P 500 ETF called the Spider SPY. And the last few days were up, 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 up. Always be suspect of an up leg with red candlesticks. See this? This is up leg with red candlesticks. This shows buying on strength or selling rather. Selling on strength. Guys, I just came back from Canada. ADD kicking in. Canada for you Canadians. I came in Winnipeg, the first day I showed up was the first day they got snow and it come blowing in and they tried to blame it on me coming in from Indianapolis that I brought in the snow and I said, it doesn't work that way, I'm from the south. <laughs> um, so <clears throat> we were there, had um, poutine, if I, am I pronouncing that right? What they do in Canada is they'll have french fries and you put gravy and cheese curds in it and Anyway, I was there with a, a business owner who owned this big restaurant, and he goes, if you haven't had poutine, you have to try it. So he brought me out some, and I tried them, and they are delightful. Anyway, um, it doesn't do anything for your health, but that was a neat dish. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Anybody could do it. All right, here we are. Looking at the markets, um, diamonds, if you look here, up, 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 kind of building a, a choppy high base, staying above the EMA, which is pretty bullish to do that. But a lot of red candlesticks here. NASDAQ, up, 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 up. And now we have, let me see, do we have a reversal pattern? Oh, this one's tough. Oh, yes. <laughs> this one's for 500 extra bonus points. If you can tell me the reversal pattern that we have on here, 500 extra bonus points for you on the NASDAQ, the Qs, QQQ. All right, let's go to the small caps. So small caps, look at the Russells. This is the Russells. IWM had a big gap up today. A near resistance area, but then sold into it down, 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 down. Look at these lower shadows. A lot of a lot of buyers coming in on that weakness at 147 and a half. A lot of buyers coming in there, but we're below the 20-day moving average at this moment. But the bigger picture, if you look here, this is we have this run up, 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 and now we're building this kind of a bull flag today. Kind of uh, it, what that wasn't good for a bull flag. A bull flag, once you get a breakout, it should have continued higher, but we didn't do that. It shows there's no conviction to this upside market, at least at this very moment. Financials, you see that we're up, 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 had a gap up, and high base above all major moving averages, all is well there. U.S. dollar had a triangle breakout, up, 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 up. I'm good with the buy call still on this one. Crude oil. Had a sell, went to a buy, up, up, up. And uh, here, the same type of reversal pattern that we saw in the Qs is here on USO. If you can tell me what that is in the comments, a lot of extra bonus points. Gold, let's go there. Gold, I have a sell, 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 sell. Put a buy on it, and then it dropped. Let, I, I'm i going to be committed to my buy, even though I'm a little underwater on this one. Silver, down, 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 down. I have a buy on it, underwater. And then it popped back up. So my buy, I'm feeling pretty good about the buy on silver. VIX, have a buy on it up, 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 up. It did drop here, but I'm still okay with my buy on that, um, on the fear. Okay, for you guys that like Bitcoin, Bitcoin's been on fire up 2% today. Up, up, up. Now what happened was Tuesday was a major break because it popped up up through a resistance. So this line now is kind of null and void. We do not have a rising wedge anymore. 
We don't have it so because it broke it to the upside. That's pretty bullish on Bitcoin. If you look at GBTC, Bitcoin right here, um, had a buy on it back here and had a nice pop the last few days. Today, they sold into that strength coming right back down and shooting star reversal pattern there. Uh, very interesting to us uh, see. And... Oh, boy, I was not going to say this. That's it for now. Okay, we'll get into more stuff later. Uh, we'll look at, like, maybe the weekend edition. I'll go through all this. Uh, before I get into what I'm going to share with you, which I can't believe I'm actually going to do this, but before I get into that, let me say that mentoring, do that this year. Get signed up for three days with us. Three days with us. We'll teach you how to trade and do it the right way. We'll teach you everything you need to know to reach your full potential in, in trading in the live markets. We've done this for a lot of people. Thousands, thousands of people we've done this for. We have a lot of full-time traders today. If you want to do it the right way, you get going on mentoring. Go to Grok Trade. Okay. And if you go to freeonlinetradingeducation.com, I'll say that slowly so you can get it free online trading education. Dot com. We have some free webinars. Go to the webinars. Take one that kind of fits who you are and where you're at in your trading. And it, they're going to help you. Very educational. Be ready to take great notes. Be ready to sit in on that. Okay. So here's the, here's some, it's an experiment that I'm doing. There's a guy that I've been helping out. And I'll, I'll give you his first name. His name's Rich. Rich, and you're probably watching this right now, Rich contacted me through uh, TradingView, which is the charts that I use here. I said, hey, would you be willing to look at a couple stocks for me personally? And so this is what I'm doing. I'm just going to do it maybe for a week just to see if it's something I want to do or anyway, I'm just an experiment from now until next Wednesday. If you want me to look at at a specific chart for you and that means i'll look at the daily weekly monthly i'll really give you the analysis on that chart of whatever stock that you're really interested in you can paypal me paypal me fifty dollars fifty bucks and i'll do it fifty bucks and i'll do it and and if for a hundred i'll do three ticker symbols for you three and I, I look at fundamentals, I look at technicals, I look at it how I would look at it if I was trading it. Anyway, to be quite frank, I don't, this isn't hardly worth my time to do, but I'll, I'll burn you a little video and then it'll be just for you to help you out. And anyway, that's what I'm doing. The, all you would want to do is send me a PayPal at my name, Des, D-E-S dot Woodruff, W-O-O-D-R-U-F-F -F, at gmail.com. That is my personal PayPal account. So just put in there either 50 bucks for one or $100 for three, and I'll analyze your stock or stocks. And I'll try to do it within 24 hours. That, and... Let's just do it for a week. And if there's too many of you guys, I may just stop it all together and I'll just continue to do this for my friends, you know. But anyway, why not? Here I threw it out there. And there's no guarantees. I, I don't guarantee anything. Uh, I will give you my professional 19 years experience, technical and fundamental outlook on it and what I see and how I would if so if you're too married to it and you can't accept bad news <laughs> it's just not for you anyway so this is just a little pet project I'm doing on the side so I'm helping out rich and I thought you know what I'll open this up to everybody else just to see so, hope you guys are well and that is it. To you Canadians, you guys are overregulated, my friends. I went up there. I could not believe how regulation just rules your life and how it's just big difference on the freedom level that we have down here in the U.S. compared to where you guys in Canada. I was really, really actually surprised by it. But enjoyed the people up there. Really loved the Canadians. 
We'll be in uh, Toronto, I think, the next time I head up. Man, I should build in some days for a class while I'm up there. Uh, anyway, I'm rambling. So, weekend editions coming up. I'll, I'll go over the Dow 30. I'll go over, uh, we got a lot of calls that we've been making on the Dow and also the tech stocks. So, hope that is helpful to you. Take care, and we'll catch you guys later.